Here's Carlos Alberto. Far post ball, no problem at all. In fact, it's gone for a number four, Carlos Alberto. Open on this side. Through ball for Pelé, and Pelé beginning to earn a fair amount of dominance in the midfield area. Carlos Alberto. There goes Paseo in. A Mazzola for Italy. Claudio Aldo is number five. Youngster, only in the side for a very short time. Jerson, Jerson constantly looking for everything in midfield. Waiting for Alberto to move to his right. But picking up Claudio Aldo inside. Jerson again. Can still use Alberto. There he is. It's an awkward ball. Well, Albertozzi punching that one away. Seemed to me that he could have let it go. But it produces another. Mazzola, two into Milan then together. And uh, Mazzola was brought down by number four, Alberto. The free kick. Four for kick. Carlos Alberto, the short one for Sado Aldo. Carlos Alberto again. Looking for Pele. Alberto. Get up. Alberto now going in behind the Italian. Offside flag is up. Offside against Pele. Alberto again. Brazil coming back again then. Alberto. Carlos Alberto. The low ball for Costello. And number five. Strike. Alberto going in. Riva already showing that he can uh, cause some trouble in this tense and what has often been described as a suspect Brazilian defense. Throwing Paseo all the way. Pedro Aldo there to pick up the loose pieces. Not a criticism you can make of that man, number four, Carlos. And again, the Italians marking up tightly at the full nine office. Alberto firing one high into the crowd. Having a quick look to see if his boots are still there. For a moment, he might have thought the boot hanging again. Carlos Alberto on this right side. Alberto not faced by an orthodox left flank forward by Italy. He's given a lot of space. For Carlos Alberto. Switching it to Jerson. Brito got in his way. Carlos Alberto. Only one Brazilian player well forward at the moment is Costello. Alberto waiting for Fork for more men to move up. Alberto. In for Tosseo, who is flagged offside. Their own pace constantly when they come forward in attack. Not being hurried into their work. Jerson, not even a senior. Italy look very dangerous when they build up slow. Carlos Alberto. Again, with plenty of space to move down this right side. Italy playing quite well at the moment. Containing Brazil very, very well. It looks as though they've just taken up their confidence after Pelé's goal. But I must say that Italy have created one of two very good... Shooting off, sorry, to whack it back in again. And again, although it caused no trouble, it was noticeable then that Brito missed his header completely in that game down at Guadalajara. Carlos Alberto. Just the tiniest bit of sun coming through over the Azteca Stadium here in Mexico City. Carlos Alberto for Jerson. Field, but it's Alberto first. Now it's Rivellino. Something the Italians have not seen a lot of in their league football in recent years. Alberto. Hardly anybody unmarked forward. Pelé giving it a try, but there he goes again. Erzino. Hardly anybody unmarked forward. Pelé giving it a try, but could Carlos Alberto, number four. Captain of this Brazilian side. Far side is Jerson from behind. Down the line, and Bocinia really fouled as Riva goes on. Play on as Italy have the advantage. For De Sisi. Mazzola's in the box. Here's Giovanchini. Not a bad try! Well, that wasn't a bad shot from a long range, and Felix made real hard work of it. Once again, Alberto advancing down the right side for Brazil. Picking up Pelé. Old, old net into which Bonnie Senior planted the equaliser. 37th minute of the 
Picking up Carlos Alberto. Pelé going in. Keep your book, Mitch. Alberto right in behind them. Oh, and there was Pelé on the near post. I think he might have hit his head on the post as he went in. No, it was his wrist that uh, hit the post. Well, that was a let-off, Bobby Moore. Here again, we saw Carlos, Al Carlos Alberto coming around the flanks. He got to the bottom. Got a right old chase then. With Claudio Aldo. Pelé. Here's Zito. Probably feels much, much better for it now. We'll probably see him try to hit the target on that right side. Oh, well, Alberto has had this much freedom in any game that he's played in the competition so far. Brito feeding Carlos Alberto again for Brazil. Brazil beginning to exploit their skills. With Brito, number two. So it's Erzino now for Brazil. Sun still trying to force its way through the clouds. It's a lot brighter than it was at a, an hour ago. Carlos Alberto moves on the right side. So 33 minutes of this half left to play. And the deadlock to be broken still by one of these teams. Tosteo coming away from Rosan. Second half. As Alberto again going deep inside this defense. Taken down by Bertini. Bertini breaking out, brought down. The free kick's been given. And the game at this moment looking like something on a, a park pitch on a Sunday morning with everybody chasing around after the ball. Look. What an incredible man to have behind you if you're a defender of this brilliant Brazilian side. Once again, the number four man coming into the picture. Number picking up Carlos Alberto. Pedro is going over to join him. But Jerson is free in the middle. That's a good ball to set the left side going now. Everaldo. We're going on to capitalize on the win in Sweden in 1958 that we capitalize on. Carlos Alberto for Jerson. And Brazil now, basically Mexican. Mexican football support. They scored against Czechoslovakia in 1962 when they last won the World Cup. Time. onto the six yard line you know for Carlos Alberto the Italians looking I'm afraid a beaten side at the moment Bonicinia Bonicinia dragging Carlos Alberto away at all very... Carlos Alberto Alberto Sosteo is there inside. and there goes Sully for the return ball incredible to think that the team that relies so heavily on its forward should have a suspect back line, but it is... It's Carlos Alberto! And what a great goal that was! <laughs> Carlos Alberto puts this game surely well beyond the reach of almost any side now. 4-1 with three and a half minutes of the game left. Carlos Alberto scores his first goal of the competition. That is the whole of the 1970 competition. A great bit of running, a fine ball from Pele, Bobby Moore. A wonderful goal there by Brazil. Good skill shown and a, a very, very well-deserved goal by Carlos Alberto. He's worked very, very hard this afternoon, trying to exploit the space that's been created on the right wing, and at last he's got something which is deserved for it. A very, very well-taken goal. I think the game is now completely over. Brazil four, four goals to one in the lead, which just about now. Carlos Alberto, the captain. What a fitting climax for his 1970 World Cup performance. Haters on the box. There are now people on the box. Now everybody's on the box.